Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back to another UDC limited events video. Today's video is a cool one actually because we are going to be playing a Roblox egg hunt. However, I just want to warn you guys at the time of recording this video, the egg is not limited, but it's kind of weird because you can do the quest early and then you can wait for it to go limited and then you can take it straight away before anybody else finishes it. So yeah, I thought that was interesting. I thought I might as well make a video on it anyway. Here's the egg. So it's called the star egg. I really like it actually. It's got like the old Roblox square studs on the top. It's got some like cracks it's got this like laser eye shining through or some star maybe i think that looks awesome so if you guys like the look of this and you would like to get it for free i just want to say i don't know how much stock it's gonna have i would assume like more than five thousand maybe ten thousand maybe more i don't quite know fingers crossed it's a lot though and the game we get this from is called souls rng so another random number game apparently to do with souls or something i don't know i've never played it looks interesting if you guys want to do this on a private server that's definitely something you can do or if if you want to do it in a public server that's also fine so go and join the game and i'll show you how to complete the egg hunt so let's go inside of the game we're going to try and speed run the whole thing the first thing you want to do is press f to talk to lime so you're going to go and speak to her and this is how you activate the egg hunt quest you want to go and accept this one and as you guys can see the first egg the pink one is literally right there you can open up your eggs menu if you want to as you can see we just got it the pink one and yeah pretty much i'm going to show you guys where all of them are there is 15 in total and they're not really that tricky to find so number two this one would be a white one we find it over here as you can see they make quite a dramatic noise when you find them we've also got another white one which is hiding in the cabinet so go and press f to take that one out and then if you guys just follow where i'm going we're gonna go up to the house on this little hill here and um yeah i would say this egg hunt is fairly simple it doesn't really take you too long it might take you about eight or nine minutes as you can see there's a purple one in here so make sure you go and collect that one then what we're gonna do guys is we're gonna do a little bit of parkour if you just want to follow me we're going to go over to these like grass jumps i guess you could call them and you just want to follow where i'm going just keep on jumping around here now there's two here but you want to get them in the right order so you want to get the orange sort of fiery one first and then once you get that one the next one is on the edge of this like a uh, grass plane and then once you collect this you will fall to your death so just like time it right don't miss it otherwise you have to walk back over there but yeah fall off get that one and as you can see we've now got quite a few so now we're going to go and get this like mud one which is by this fence over here this brown looking minecraft fence if you just have a look uh, just very close to it you can find it there you go there it is then what we're going to do guys is go over to the other side of the map there is another one we need to find we need to find it this yellow one as you guys can see there's a little tree there so um, that helps you get back up so collect the yellow one jump back up and you should be all good now what we're going to move on to the second section so i would say these ones were the easier eggs i think there's one more egg to get which is out in the open and then the rest of them are inside of this giant mountain volcano looking thing so yeah if you just do a bit of rock climbing you can find this brown looking dirt one go and collect that one then if you just climb up the ladder here yes we are actually going into this mountain or whatever it is so just jump through the waterfall be careful not to fall off otherwise you have to do it again and what i would say about this mountain guys is it's a bit dark sometimes it's a bit hard to see where you're going but i'm gonna try my best to show you guys where all of them are as long as you pay close attention to where i'm walking you should be fine so you want to take a left you want to go over to this waterfall and if you just walk through it you can find a shiny blue one inside of here i couldn't see where it was at first but then i saw it in the corner i was like oh yeah there you go i'll give you a tip actually if you roll and just get like uh i don't even know what the heck these things are they're like glowing things sometimes they can brighten up your path a little bit so i got a rare blue one and that helped me out anyway continue follow where i'm going you want to jump over these rocks which are just like uh, on top of the lava there this one we're about to get is a fairly secret one and you actually have to walk through the wall to get it so as you can see there's the uh walk through wall and this one is a dull looking gray egg so go and collect that one now the next one we're gonna get guys is also kind of tricky to find well not really that tricky it's just hard to see where you're going so jump to your death because you want to respawn and yeah just follow where i'm going this way just continue going in this direction and you see that bridge that bridge we knocked down earlier well we're going to be using this again what you guys want to do is try and get across it as quick as possible for me i'm so slow so it collapsed now if this happens to you don't worry you can either wait for it to respawn in or if you just jump up these like bricks here literally the rocks you can get up there easily and then yeah once you're up here you just want to walk down this little pathway and you should be able to find the green one this emerald green egg go and collect this one now i think we're nearly done we've only got a few left if you guys just carry on going where i'm going go over the bridge then you want to go in this direction do a bit of parkour to climb up these rocks i know this cave is like incredibly dark and sometimes it's hard to see where you're going but yeah hopefully you can see so i'm just going to carry on going this direction climb up here you should be able to find all of these candles or sparklers or whatever 
they are. Eventually you'll get to this area where it has this like yellow water. I don't know what it is, but there is an egg in there and you can also find this pink one inside of this tent. So go and collect this one. And I think guys, we should be on 14. So if you just watch where I'm going now, we can get the final one, which honestly is not tricky to find. It just blends in with its surroundings a bit because it's like a black one. It's very dark. It's quite hard to see in this map. It's literally like a pitch black egg, uh, but you should be able to find it just here. So go and collect it. I know it kind of looks like a rock. But once you've got this one, you can like leave the game, rejoin if you want to, or you can get out the cave. It's up to you. And if you just go and press F to talk to Lime again, she's basically going to say, whoa, you finally found all of them. Congratulations. You get the idea. And if you guys go and open up the egg menu, you should be able to claim the UDC. I might release this when the UDC is ready, or if it's taken the majors, I might just release the video anyway. Because yes, unfortunately, as you can see at the time of recording this, it's currently not available. So when it is available, I'll join the game. I'll go and take it. I don't know the amount of stock. I guess it's going to be a lot. And there you go. That's how you find all 15 eggs. Pretty simple. I thought that was quite an easy egg hunt, actually. Not too difficult. So there you go. That's how you get it. Obviously, just keep an eye out on this thing. So when it goes limited, you can quickly join the game and you can go and take it. Maybe I'll pin a comment letting you guys know when it's limited or something.